Hey guys, this is Cussing Kleenex, aka Kleenex Up the Flash, uh, brought to you by www.moddedcrew.com, bringing you a tutorial of the ping patch for x Links Kai. This is so you can play against other people on x Links Kai. Uh, if you don't have a decent connection, uh, you need a JTAG to do this. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and show you how it's uh, relatively easy you need a couple programs I will have these programs on moddedcrew.com this program right here is one of them freeboot uh, toolbox flash installer and the patch itself which is right here and you need the freeboot patches so let's get started. First thing you want to do is put the patch on your hard drive. Uh, there's a couple different ways to do this. I'm just doing it this way because I'm just working off my computer. It's just a lot easier for me. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. <clears throat> Okay, now that's all. and set. Now what we need to do is open up Freeboot uh, Toolbox. Now, first thing you need to do is you need to get your CPU key. And you need to go ahead and copy that. What is this? Uh and paste it right here paste okay now next thing you need to do is you need to make sure there's a couple boxes checked off dash log launch 1.0 need to have NAND checked off creating a custom freeboot that has to be checked off auto detect motherboard doesn't have to be checked off but it is highly recommended and you need file name destination check off up the flash dot bin alright so let's go ahead and check all those off alright <clears throat> next step you need to hit other directory open up this box go ahead and hit desktop because you want to save everything to your desktop hit ok Alright, now come on here and hit Generate Freeboot. It's going to pop open a box. Now what you need to do is you need to open up the NAND that you extracted from your JTAG when you first got it. This line right here. So go ahead and open that up and hit Open. And again, go ahead and save it to the desktop. Hit OK. Now it's going to... Now it's going to ask you if your motherboard is Xenon. Yes, mine is Xenon. So hit yes. Yes, I want to overwrite the old UpD flash bin because I used it last night for a KV. So go ahead and overwrite it. So hit yes. Now it's going to start writing. And then it's going to stop about 80%. Okay. Do not hit OK on that box. This is where you need to copy... Um, some files. You need to go ahead and open up the bin. And you see this um, patch underscore xenon bin. You need to replace this one with the one that I supplied with you for 
for you. Excuse me. And for some reason, I have a feeling it's not going to be in there. And it's not. So give me one second, and I'm going to re-download it. I'm just going to pause the video. Okay, sorry about that, guys. I'm Alright, so now what you need to do, this is all off together so you don't have to mess around with it like I am. You gotta go into the free boot patches and find your motherboard, which mine is a Xenon. Take this, drag, and drop it right into here. It's gonna ask you if you wanna move and replace, of course you do. Okay, and you're done. So now go ahead and exit out of that. Exit out of that. Now hit OK, and it's going to create <coughs> the up the flash broke uh, dot bin. All right, and it just created it. It's right here. Okay, so go ahead and hit OK. Close that out. Alright, now what you want to do is you want to take this up the flash dot bin and flash installer and you want to put it on your memory drive. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, now that we got that on, you can go ahead and start up your JTAG. And I'm going to stop the video here. And I'm going to make a, a second video, alright? So I'll see you on part two.